So we'll go to Everybody. Mr. Butthead. In Mr. Butthead? <laughs> Remember, this I'm, is only reading, I'm only yeah. reading. I'm only reading. Installed Ubuntu 9.04 with no problems. However, the native resident monitor has placed the upper menu bar off the screen. Mm -hmm. At this time, there's nothing that I can do to shrink this down to size where I can just select rather than hunt and pack to find the drop down menu. NVIDIA right. drivers are installed. Uh, Samsung HD monitor, NVIDIA 9800 GTX card, and thanks in advance. Now, when you say that there's nothing you can do to shrink this down to size, what's what's the, the upper the upper menu bar is off the screen? It sounds to me like, but this is an HD TV that you're connecting it to. It's a Samsung HD monitor. See, I'm now I'm sneaking peeks at her monitor here. Mm -hmm. um, it could be. Now it's rare with uh, with a digital monitor, but it could be overscan. If if your computer is detecting it as a TV, what you need to do is you need to go System Administration NVIDIA X Server Settings, and if it's being detected as a TV, you're going to have something called overscan. See this guy, and what that does. Now watch your screen because we're in TV mode right now. Okay, if I do this. See how it moves the black area hmm. in and out? See that? So that's with like a lo like zero, and if I go way up, it's going to fill the entire window. Mm -hmm. What Overscan is designed for is to basically resolve that very issue with TVs in that there's basically a frame that is un that's not visible to those televisions. So if mm -hmm. your HD monitor or HD screen is being detected as a TV, it might have to do with Overscan. It's possible. It's rare. Like I say, it's it's much more of a CRT problem. It's uh, it's not necessarily going to happen on a, a, a LCD, but again, if it's detected as a TV, it might. Other than that, of course, it, it, I wonder if it's a resolution issue. It, using that same application, NVIDIA X Server Settings, which is NVIDIA Dash Settings, if you want to run it with Alt F2, if, because you can't see that menu, it might be hard for you to click on it. Hit Alt F2, is going to bring up your uh, your run dialog. Uh, where am I? Here we go. So when you when you do it that way, you can just go NVIDIA dash settings, and then that's going to run the same application without having to use the menu system. Okay. Hmm. So from there, you can change the resolution as well. So you've got uh, you know all your resolutions in this pull down. So make sure you set it to one that's compatible with that monitor. Because it's going to be specific to that monitor as well, you might want to go through the on-screen. Uh, I know that uh, now I was working on a system just recently. It had this horrible display. It was like, I don't know, 30, 37 inches or something like that. It was massive. It was like this. It was like wow. so. And and they were having a similar issue. And I just walked through the uh, functions on the screen of the display. So pushing the little buttons on the front of the display, I was able to walk through and re kind of scale that monitor down to fit uh, to fit everything in so and that that fixed the problem for them so I wouldn't I wouldn't rule that out either maybe go through if there's an auto mode try it first see if it will automatically detect and scale uh, if not then try walking through it manually and do some positioning on the screen maybe uh, use a scale or something like that mm. so but it's, it'll be different per per display <laughs>